Hey y'all, how you doing? Shannon Zimmerman here in my craft studio, really aka hot mess of a basement. We won't show you that, but what I am going to show you today is how to make a Santa tool wreath. Now this is the first time I've done it, but it looks pretty easy, so let's give it a try. Okay, first off, for your supplies. Now you need 50 yards of white tool. I've got more than enough here. I've even got some sparkle tool because I like everything to sparkle. You also need a white foam wreath. Now it calls for a 12 inch wreath form. Mine is 10 inch because my Santa hat, for some reason, is teeny tiny. I didn't pay attention to what size I was getting. So 12 inch wreath form, really whatever works that your hat will fit on. You also need either just a regular ruler or I have a yardstick here because you're gonna cut this tool into 15 inch strips. So whatever makes it easier for you or whatever you've got on hand. You need scissors, of course your handy dandy GG or glue gun, and also you'll need a needle and thread and a piece of scrap ribbon, but we'll get to that a little bit later. Are you ready? Let's make okay, this thing. So first up, you lay your Santa hat on your little wreath form here and mark a line. That's obviously where the uh, hat meets the wreath on either side, and that's as long as, or as high, I guess I should say, as you have to tie the tool to. So now that we've got it marked, we're ready yeah. to cut. As you can see, I have two piles of tool, only two piles of pre-cut strips because some is sparkly, yay, and some is just basic tool. And I've started tying, mixing in my sparkle and my regular tool. And all you need to do is tie a basic knot. You start at the one line you drew, and then you'll go all the way around to this. Now, if you're thinking, dang, that's a lot of tying, that's a lot of cutting, honestly, it doesn't take that long. I cut all those strips and was able to tie this in just about not even 10 minutes. So once you get the hang of it, it's really easy. So I'll keep cutting and tying. The finished product is coming soon. Okay, we're going on maybe 20 minutes total and I'm over halfway through. Uh, still cutting and tying. Just a couple words of advice. Now, first off, for say you couldn't find white foam ring. That's okay. You can use green foam. Those exist too. You'll just need to be sure to wrap your white tool around where you're going to be tying just so none of the green shows through. So that's the first piece of advice. Second piece of advice. See this pretty sparkly tool? Yes. Very pretty. Adds a little sass and sparkle, which is all great, but it makes a hot mess of your surroundings. So just keep that in mind if you decide to use the sparkle tool. You might want to go in your nasty basement like I am <laughs> so you can make as big a mess as oh, you want to. The beard is now tied. Now you're probably thinking, what is this? Well, Santa is not Santa without a mustache, right? So all I've done is about two inches down from the start where the line is, I took a leather piece of tool, a longer piece, cut it from my spool here, wrapped it around from front to back, see? And then I just tied it really tight here in the middle. Then what I'm gonna do, hopefully you've got some of your 15 inch tool strips still left. I'm just gonna fold them in half and cut them so they're half the size, and then I'm gonna tie them back on this string to make Santa's mustache. Hello. Okay, Santa now has his mustache and his nice sparkly beard, and we're almost done. We just now need to attach his hat. So what I'm gonna do is take my glue gun here and put a nice roll of glue on those lines to make sure that it holds on nice and tight. Okay, we're now on to the final, final step, I promise. Now, first off, I took a little of my extra tool and put it in my Santa hat here to give it a little extra poof so it would stand up nicely. So there's a, just a little trick you might wanna try. And finally, now we're gonna sew a loop on the back, of course, so you can hang it. I've got a piece of scrap ribbon here. I'm just gonna loop it like that. I'm going to sew it right onto the back of my Santa okay, hat. Okay, we have our loop. Santa's all done. Now for the defining moment. Because I can't show you my sew job because it's quite embarrassing. <gasps> oh, yeah! He's beautiful! Merry Christmas! 